Happy Thanksgiving, boys and girls. I hope you're having a great day. And I wanted to share another Thanksgiving book with you today. So I know we've had some fun ones, and I think you're going to like this one too. It's called, I Know an Old Lady Who Swallowed a Pie. Now, it might remind you of a story that we just read a couple weeks ago called, I Know an Old Lady Who Swallowed a Bat. Imagine that. She swallowed the bat. Okay. Well, this is written by Allison Jackson. The pictures are by Judith Byron Shoniker. And it's just a fun Thanksgiving story. Now, when I'm done reading this, I'm going to ask you if you think that this is a fiction, a phony baloney fun story, or if it's nonfiction, a real story based on with real facts and real information. So I'll see what you think. The picture on the cover is probably giving you a clue already. So put on your listening ears, and I'm going to put on my glasses, and we are going to read. Okay. I know an old lady who swallowed a pie. There she is making it, isn't she? I know an old lady. I, who swallowed a pie. A Thanksgiving pie, which really was too dry. Perhaps she'll die. Oh my goodness, I hope not. I know an old lady who swallowed some cider. There she is drinking the whole thing. That rumbled and mumbled and grumbled inside her. She swallowed the cider to moisten the pie. The Thanksgiving pie, which was really too dry. Perhaps she'll die. I know an old lady who swallowed a roll. Just swallowed it whole, the entire roll. She swallowed the roll to go with the cider that rumbled and mumbled and grumbled inside her. She swallowed the cider to moisten the pie, the Thanksgiving pie, which is really too dry. Perhaps she'll die. I know an old lady who swallowed a squash. Oh my gosh, a fat yellow squash. She swallowed the squash to go with the roll. She swallowed the roll to go with the cider that rumbled and mumbled and grumbled inside her. She swallowed the cider to moisten the pie, the Thanksgiving pie that was really too dry. Perhaps she'll die. I know an old lady who swallowed a salad. She was looking quite pallid from eating that salad. She swallowed the salad to go with the squash. She swallowed the squash to go with the roll. She swallowed the roll to go with the cider that rumbled and, mum and mumbled and grumbled inside her. She swallowed the cider to moisten the pie, the Thanksgiving pie, which was really too dry. Perhaps she'll die. I know an old lady who swallowed a turkey. Oh my goodness, they don't want her to get their Thanksgiving turkey, do they? Her future looked murky after that turkey. She swallowed the turkey to go with the salad. She swallowed the salad to go with the squash. She swallowed the squash to go with the roll. She swallowed the roll to go with the cider that rumbled and mumbled and grumbled inside her. She swallowed the cider to moisten the pie, the Thanksgiving pie, which was really too dry. Perhaps she'll die. I know an old lady who swallowed a pot. Oh my gosh, she's crazy. I kid you not, she swallowed a pot. She swallowed the pot to go with the turkey. She swallowed the turkey to go with the salad. She swallowed the salad to go with the squash. She swallowed the squash to go with the roll. She swallowed the roll to go with the cider that rumbled and bumbled and grumbled inside her. She swallowed the cider to moisten the pie, the Thanksgiving pie, which was really too dry. Perhaps she'll die. I know an old lady who swallowed a cake. For goodness sake, a 10 layer cake?
She swallowed the cake to go with the pot. She swallowed the pot to go with the turkey. She swallowed the turkey to go with the salad. She swallowed the salad to go with the squash. She swallowed the squash to go with the roll. She swallowed the roll to go with the cider that rumbled and bumbled and grumbled inside her. She swallowed the cider to moisten the pie, the Thanksgiving pie, which was really too dry. Perhaps she'll die. Now, if you look here, mom, they're, they're tying something onto her foot there. It looks like a rope. I know an old lady who swallowed some bread. Happy Thanksgiving. I'm full, she said. Now, I want you to look at this picture. And it says, Happy Thanksgiving, and it's a parade. It's a Thanksgiving Day parade, just like the Macy's Thanksgiving to parade that you can see on television on Thanksgiving morning. And they have those huge balloons where lots and lots of people have to hold on to all the strings to keep the balloons from floating away. And she got so big, they entered her as a balloon in the parade. So that's how it ended. So do you think this is a real story or is it phony baloney fiction? I think you're right, it's fiction because I, if she ate that much food, she's not just gonna float in the air and be in a balloon in a parade. But it's a fun story and I love to look at all the characters' faces in the story and um, throughout the story and all the different pictures. So I hope you enjoyed that. Um, draw me a fun Thanksgiving picture that you can think of from your favorite part of the story and write a few sentences about it, okay? I will see you soon. Great listening, boys and girls. Have a great day.